Samsung is about to take foldable smartphones to the next level with its first ever trifold device. While we haven't seen it in action just yet, recent leaks and industry reports have given us a good idea of what to expect. And interestingly, it looks like this upcoming device, tentatively called the Galaxy G Fold, will share a major similarity with the Galaxy Z Fold 7. Triple folding devices are gradually making their way into the market. Huawei has already made a move with its Mate XT, and now Samsung is expected to follow suit with its own take on the concept. Though details are still emerging, reliable sources have given us some key insights into what we can anticipate from this new foldable smartphone. One of the most well-known industry insiders, Ross Young, has shared a new detail that adds to the growing picture of this device. According to him, the Galaxy G Fold will feature a 6.49-inch cover screen. If that number sounds familiar, it's because it's the same size that the Galaxy Z Fold 7 is expected to have. This means that, at least from the outside, the G Fold and Z Fold 7 might look very similar when folded. To put things into perspective, the Galaxy Z Fold 6 has a 6.3-inch cover display, meaning the Z Fold 7 will see a slight increase in size. Interestingly, the Galaxy Z Fold Special Edition already features a 6.49-inch panel, which seems to be carrying over to the global Z Fold 7. While this may not be a groundbreaking change, it does highlight Samsung's decision to streamline its foldable lineup. However, making the Z Fold 7 and the Galaxy G Fold look so similar could be a risky move. The G Fold is expected to cost significantly more, so customers will need to see a clear distinction between the two devices beyond just their primary display. The big difference, of course, will be how these two foldables function. Unlike the Mate XT, which uses a single 10.2-inch panel that folds both inward and outward, Samsung is reportedly opting for a different approach. The Galaxy G Fold is said to feature two separate panels, folding inward twice to fully enclose the main screen when not in use. This should provide better protection against external damage, making it a more durable device overall. This design choice has its pros and cons. On the positive side, the G Fold's inward folding design enhances durability and usability, especially if reports suggesting a main display size of around 10 inches are accurate. On the downside, using two separate screens instead of a single large panel could lead to a higher price tag and a heavier device. Given that Huawei's Mate XT is already on the expensive side, the G Fold might push the boundaries even further in terms of cost. Another factor to consider is software optimization. A trifold device introduces new challenges for software developers as apps and user interfaces must seamlessly transition across multiple screens. Samsung has a strong history of optimizing one UI for foldables. Samsung's first trifold device could set a new standard for durability and functionality. The big question now is whether consumers will be willing to pay the expected premium for this next generation foldable. What are your thoughts on Samsung's upcoming trifold device? Would you consider buying one if the price is right? Let us know in the comments below. And if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell for more updates on the latest mobile innovations. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next one. Galaxy S25 series today in San Jose, California, marking the debut of three exciting models. The Galaxy S25, Galaxy S25 Plus, and Galaxy S25 Ultra. Just hours before the grand unveiling, retail boxed images surfaced, showcasing the lineup in their sleek packaging. The leak confirms that the boxes are thin, with no inbox charger included, continuing Samsung's trend of reducing packaging waste. Among the colors revealed, the Galaxy S25 comes in a refined gray, the S25 Plus dazzles in dark blue, and the S25 Ultra stuns in its titanium ice blue finish. Samsung's bold design choices are evident in the Ultra model, which retains its signature S Pen slot while sporting rounded edges for a more comfortable grip. Under the hood, all models are powered by the Snapdragon 8 Elite chipset, a custom for Galaxy version that is overclocked for enhanced performance. The base Galaxy S25 model offers 128GB of storage, a somewhat disappointing figure, but Samsung compensates with a boost in RAM to 12GB across all base models. For storage options, the lineup includes 256GB as standard, with 512GB available for users requiring more space. Hands-on images have added last-minute excitement, offering an early look at the Galaxy S25 series. The leaks reveal a redesigned, slender retail box that emphasizes the phone's frames and cameras. The Ultra's design features premium-looking camera rings, flat sides, and a streamlined back panel, further enhancing comfort and aesthetics. Color options across the series include mint and silver shadow for the Galaxy S25, navy blue for the S25 Plus, and titanium gray for the S25 Ultra. 
Exclusive online-only colors such as blue, black, coral red, and pink gold provide even more variety for buyers. In terms of pricing, Samsung is keeping the base prices steady compared to the Galaxy S24 series in South Korea. This decision, despite rising production costs and a higher USD to Korean won exchange rate, is seen as a win for consumers worldwide. However, higher storage variants see a slight increase. Here's the pricing breakdown for the base 256 gigabytes models. Galaxy S25, 1,155,000 Korean won, $796. Galaxy S25 Plus, 1,353,000 Korean won, $933. Galaxy S25 Ultra, 1,694,000 Korean won, $1,171. Higher storage variants will cost. Galaxy S25, 512 GB, 1,313,500 Korean won, $962. Galaxy S25 Plus, 512 gigabytes, 1,511,400 Korean won, $1,429. Galaxy S25 Ultra, 512 gigabytes, 1,858,600 Korean won, $1,281. These prices are competitive given the global use of the Snapdragon 8 Elite chipset, which is 20% more expensive than its predecessor. One of the standout features of the Galaxy S25 series is Galaxy AI, included free of charge through 2025. This advanced AI capability enhances user experience by offering features such as night video with audio eraser. This innovative tool allows users to capture stunning videos in low light while reducing both video grain and background audio noise. Samsung has also upgraded the selfie cameras for lifelike skin tones and textures, ensuring top-notch photo quality. The Galaxy S25 lineup also introduces varying battery capacities to suit different needs. Galaxy S25, 4000 mAh. Galaxy S25 Plus, 4900 mAh. Galaxy S25 Ultra, 5000 mAh. As expected, the S Pen remains exclusive to the Galaxy S25 Ultra, bundled within the box. For display enthusiasts, the series offers impressive screen sizes. 6.2 inches for the S25, 6.7 inches for the S25 Plus, and a massive 6.9 inches for the S25 Ultra. The Ultra also leads the pack with a 200 megapixel main camera, and all the other models feature 50 megapixel primary sensors. Samsung's ecosystem features are also highlighted in the Galaxy S25 series. Smart Switch makes it seamless to transfer data from your old device, while Samsung Digital Wallet provides a secure hub for credit cards, warning passes, and more. For Galaxy users, daily news briefings will deliver morning and evening updates on weather, top stories, and other essentials. What's your take on the Galaxy S25 series pricing and features? Are you excited about the design, performance, or AI capabilities? Let me know in the comments below. And don't forget to reserve your Galaxy S25 through the link in the description to take advantage of exclusive offers. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to hit the like button, subscribe for more updates on the latest gadgets, and turn on notifications so you'd never miss a future upload. Stay tuned for more exciting content, and I'll see you in the next one. Hey Samsung fans, the moment we've all been waiting for is almost here. The Galaxy S25 series is set to be unveiled at the highly anticipated Galaxy Unpacked event on January 22nd. But here's the deal.